Hello and welcome back to another episode of World War II History and Reenacting. Today, we are going to take a look at another item from my personal collection of original Militaria, as I have received numerous requests for these kinds of videos lately. This is a uniform used by a member of Organisation TOT, with the rank of UT Arbeiter, which is the lowest rank in the TOT organization. Organisation TOT, commonly known as UT, was originally established in 1933 under the command of Dr. Fritz TOT, a construction engineer who had been a member of the National Socialist German Workers' Party since 1923. The organization was responsible for a huge range of engineering projects, both in World War II Germany and later in Germany and also occupied territories during the war. UTE personnel consisted mostly of trained civil engineers and laborers, but they also became notorious for using forced labor. Uniforms for UTE members were introduced shortly after the outbreak of World War II and were very similar to the uniforms worn by the German National Labour Service, known as the RAD, Reiches Arbeitsdienst. This uniform is a mid to late war double chested mantle, or greatcoat, made from coarse brown wool. It features a wide collar and sewed French cuffs, roughly in the style of what collectors named the M42 or Model 42 greatcoat. There are two rows of field grey colored buttons, six in each row, all the same type and color, except for one. The color insignia has the letters OT embroidered onto the woolen background, with a deep red colored thread. The insignia is machine sewn to the collar, and probably factory applied. The mantle is lined with grey rayon fabric. Stamped inside is an organization top property stamp, and a second stamp that I am unable to read. It is probably a production or depot stamp. The uniform is in pristine and almost mint condition. That's all for now. I hope you all enjoyed this video and as always please comment, rate and subscribe. And until next time, Auf Wiedersehen.